Hi, this is the Balkan Architect and in this video I will show you how you can model a spiral ramp in Revit. So let's say we have this parking garage construction thing and we have this car over here and we need to get it to a level above. So we need to get it from this point to this point and we're going to do it by using a spiral ramp. So we're not going to be using any massing tools, you can do this just by creating a floor. So I'm going to go to level 1, here we have the car, and I'm just going to go to floor and to circle, find the midpoint and pull it out let's say 9 meters and let's create a, one inside that's 6 meters wide. Okay, now once we've done that we can create a line that goes across here and then we use the split tool, SL is the shortcut and we cut these at these three places and then we use the trim command TR and we just do that this here and there okay and now we're done we go finish model and we go back into 3D and you can see this is just a flat half circle or half donut thing and now you go to modify sub elements you select this line over here and you can type in a number here so I'm just going to select it and go 4 meters because that is this height over here so I'm just going to type 4 and there you go now I have basically a spiral ramp for my car to go up and I'm just going to copy it to upper levels by using copy and then on the clipboard you go align to selected levels so you select from level 2 through level 5, actually through level 4 we don't need going up above level 5, I'm just gonna hit OK and there you go. So we have basically the spiral ramp for our parking garage. Okay that's pretty much it for this video, thank you for watching, please subscribe, like and share this video, leave a comment if you have any suggestions or questions for further tutorials and have a nice day.